Um, so, yeah, uh, we're back, and, um, this is actually the first, uh, stream of this game after I have uploaded the first episode onto, uh, my YouTube channel. So, uh, yeah, I just decided, like, you know, spur of the moment, like, you know what, I'm just, I'm not really doing anything with the Michael Dude YouTube channel, so fuck it, I'm just gonna start uploading cassette beasts. Yeah! Southpaw. Didn't we already do that? Am I crazy? Might be crazy. Uh, so what's our party? Okay, we got Masqueradle, Southpaw, Spitzfire, Palangolin, Mascator, and Fountess. And hang on. Kaylee, get off the table. What's in storage? Yes, so I took Cat 5 off of Meredith and Cloxley off of uh, what's his face? Because I think those might be the only way that you can get a hold of those. Oh my god, did you see that on the rug? They're freaking uh, aux input cables. As a uh, Ivy, or maybe I'm crazy. Mike, how do strings refer to starting a note? We call it articulation. Um, I think that's the same. Yeah, for like actually, yeah, and that without some. Is there a specific term for it? I think it's just articulation. Um, I thought there was like a term for fingering. But I can't remember. Because I think just calling it fingerings a little lewd. Hmm. We did mascot torn at the end of last time. Okay. Have you been to Ham before? Uh, his his stream? Yeah, plenty of times. You know that little valley west of East Ham Woods where Captain Lodestein hangs out? Ooh. New Captain rumor. Um, what was I about to say? What was I about to say, guys? Um, wait, let me check something. Yes, okay, so um, I did a little bit of stuff off stream. One of them included uh, completing a bunch of rumors for Professor What's-His-Face. And, um, yeah, so in the process of doing that, he wanted a bulletino, which apparently after catching a bulletino, it lets you do this. So we now have a really fast run. And then also, he wanted us to catch a dive eel, and after you catch a dive eel, you can swim. So, um... 
we now have uh, more abilities unlocked. So that's a thing. Not loot as fingering the a-hole on clarinet. Oh no. Got ambushed by slimes in the marshes, and some caped super heroine jumped in to save me. I'm not making it up, honest. Ooh. Uh, well, that was the direction I wanted to go anyway, so. Oops. Oh, wait, can I, um, yeah, I think I can float up here now. Oh, do I need to... There we go. What? Oh, you can go all the way up. Damn, what? There we go. What? Galactic Beatdown. Hits one target, cannot be evaded. This is what I saw someone else get from a treasure chest. And I was super jelly. I think. Wait, did I already... I didn't have that before, did I? I did. Oh, I got it. Now I'm mixing up things, man. Oh, God. I think it's just because like I can't give that to anyone yet. So I haven't used it. Oh god. Ah! Platforming puzzles in my Pokemon clone. <gasps> Alright, fuck this. I can actually explore this stuff now. Oh my god, a vampire is swimming in the ocean? What's up? We can also help provide liquid <laughs> liquidity for your home purchase. Get it? Um, so yeah, I guess I can, like, just, like, talk about general stuff now. Um, so yeah, Street Fighter Six beta's dropping, um, in a couple weeks. Um, 19th through the 21st. So, I think the plan for that is just gonna be, like, assuming I haven't beaten Cassette Piece, Cassette Beasts by then. I think it will just, like... Let's see if I can dual wield now. Ow. Oh, it's water type. I didn't even realize. I thought it was just beast. I don't have the AP. Is plastic good against water? Um, yeah, so I'm just gonna do like, you know, Final Fantasy 15 and then um, boot up the beta, right? And then, um, outside of that, I'll probably just be labbing a bunch of shit on, like, offline.
But first and foremost, gonna be checking out Kimberly. Because uh, she's the one that I was most interested in playing. Man, why is my neck just fucked whenever I... <sighs> Seems like my neck just starts fucking hurting whenever I, like, stream lately. Yeah, I'll start exploring some shit. Oh, there's land down here. Ooh, breakers. Revenge? Um, oh yeah, and uh, Zelda Tears of the Kingdom is coming out on Friday. And I will not be getting it day one. <laughs> um, oh, also apparently you can dash into these rocks to break them. Um, I'm just gonna be watching other people play it just to like get a good idea of what's different about it because of all of the the pre-release leaked bullshit that I've seen so far it seems like it's mostly more of the same but maybe some more oh we we're in West Harbor town now uh, maybe some more like dungeon stuff Don't worry about the traffic crab, that's just my son. He loves playing with his bootleg tape. Bootleg? Yeah, have you ever seen a monster in your travels that isn't its normal color? That's a that's a bootleg, but don't confuse it with a coating. Have you ever seen a monster that's not normal? Bootleg monsters permanently have different colors, different elemental types, and different moves from usual. And when you record them, they keep those attributes. Recorded bootlegs have a high rate of producing uncommon and rare moves, so they can be very useful. Here, why don't you take this and see for yourself? Captain Cody gives me his spare, so I have plenty already. Sparktan! What the shit? Sparktans are living thunderclouds. Their arms are formed of concentrated electrical energy and can be extended at will. They prefer to live at higher altitudes, where they can quietly amass more cloud matter. And it's ice type. Okay. Cool. Bootleg monsters can appear anywhere at random, but apparently they're more often seen in fusions. I've heard that some very rare bootleg monsters sparkle and shine like as if they're covered in glitter. Oh shit. It's because I'm a huge pain in the neck. See, when you go one on one with a normal traffic crab! The son of gold light tan? Maybe. I hope. If I had any advice for you, it would be to embrace your new life here. That doesn't mean you should also forget the life you used to have, though. You're as much your past as you are your future. That's deep. Harbortown Heritage Center, charting the history of our unlikely community. Hello! Elemental chemistry is the key to success in combat. I designed stickers that give you control of chemistry and the advantage in battle. What the shit? Whoa. Cool. I specialize in stickers that change the type with the user. Very handy if you're also using my colleague's codings. Oh, okay, she gives you all the neutral type attacks. Cool. The old one, too. Oh, that's what the, uh, the Archangel used on us. 
That sounds really good, actually. I'm gonna take a couple of those. Um, let's see if we can open this bridge. Kaylee, can you, like... Oh! Neat! Um... Did that solve a quest? I thought I remember a quest that's like something's going on in West Harbor Town. I don't know. Or just do that. Eugene's place? Oh yeah, Eugene is his name. I'm just gonna call him What's-His-Face. I bet you'd never expect to see someone as famous as me here, did you? Wait, don't you recognize me? Oh. Damn, Elton John got isekai'd. Pardon me, but are you involved with the Rangers? Yeah. Okay. okay! Wonderful! I'm a fellow Ranger. Well, a trainee at least. Perhaps you could lend me a hand? I've got some plant saplings grown by the Pipers over on their farm. They're for prettying up the town. However, I'm not great at decision making. Which plants would look best? It's too much. Would you help a fellow Ranger out and put some saplings in the planters I've left around town? Sure. Now we're playing Animal Crossing. Changes the type of the user or an ally. Plus four experience. Oh yeah. Oh hey, you came to hang out. You want to see what I rescued from the sad remains of my old place? Sure. So in my regular life, I was a zot arti zone artist? Hmm. It's easier to show. Check this out. So this is a zone reel. You slot it into this uh, zoe zoetrope right here, then look through the slot. The zone trope has a motor in it, so when I- I'll bet it does. So when I hit this button, it spins. The row of the zone strip has the same image drawn over and over with variations. When spun around, it animates and comes to life, right? Then you can pull the lever, Kronk, to switch to the next row for the next part of the story. You can tell a whole story and bring it to life just with drawings. I've been obsessed with Zone ever since I was a kid. I'll bet you have. They used to be very popular, though they've kind of fallen out of fa- <laughs> Damn! Savage. It's more of a niche medium now, at least where I am from, I mean. Most Zone stories are about heroes in the French Revolution. Huh. Like the Scarlet Pimpernel, but ever since the big budget movie adaptations really took off, there's been less interest in the source material. I got into these stories as a kid and couldn't shake couldn't shake my love for them. I guess that's why I'm an artist now. Hmm. Right now I'm trying to come up with some new characters. And it turns out an island full of weird monsters is the perfect place to find inspiration. It's like plagiarism, but completely innocent. Which means you might be able to help me out. 
I'm searching for a particular creature and want to get good at a good look at one. I know you can find it in the Cherry Meadow. It's a warrior with a wooden sword. Can you help me out? Sure. Cool. I'll mark it on your map. Hey, there we go. He was a Miiverse animator? Makes sense. Bushroom? Whoa! Bushrooms are keen artists and paints using the strange pigments that ooze from their heads. It has been observed that they are able to change the physical properties of an object they paint over depending on the color they use. Cool. Plastic and grass? Huh. Oh man, I'm stuck. Oh. She took my freaking southpaw. God damn it. Let me at least get Southpaw back before I go with you. Can I even do that? Here, you can take, uh... Palangolin. Oh. What the fuck am I doing? I don't need you. I'll do whatever I want. Do whatever I want. Get back over here, Kaylee. All right, where are we going? Um. Yeah, which quest was this again? Super heroin. We're gonna go get some super heroin. We're not just licking frogs anymore. It's a friendly dog! After extending your hand to let the dog sniff you, you check his collar. The dog's name is Barkley, and there's a miniature tape recorder attached to his collar. There's no information about his owner here other than a 22-digit telephone number. Barkley must be stuck in New World 2. If this is an optimal character design, I don't know what is. Barkley's looking up the cliff and whining. He must want to go up. He won't move from this spot, perhaps if you had some way to take him up the cliff. Gnarls Barkley. I hope it can be a part... Oh, that'd be amazing. It reminds me of that uh, Pomeranian from um, Ghost Trick that everyone freaks out over. We'll camp.
I bet you there's an ability to climb those. How do I how do I get up? Where's Mark Echo? What the shit are these things? Aha. Uh -huh. Okay, so this changes the bottom three, or bottom left. This changes top right. Okay, so it's just that. Excuse me, Kaylee. Glass coating. Hello! Are you here to research the pint-sized Dominoth rumor, too? The gossip points to this location, but so far I've only seen regular-sized Dominoth. Maybe it all has something to do with the train that passed by underground a moment ago. We found a magnet. Captain Buffy's been helping me out with the strength training regimen. Here, check out my guns! Oh god, please have... Yes! <laughs> Velocirifles. rifles. Perfect. Um... Oh shit. You're gonna wreck me. Out. Ow, ow. Damn. Man, my fusion meter is going super fast now. Guess I'll go ahead and go to Masquerade. Holy shit! Artiller Rex! I'm gonna need that. I'm gonna need that right now. Beast wall. Acorn Mortar? <laughs> I was just gonna help it. Oh well. Cool.
Damn, that's awesome looking. Hypnotize. Wait. Who trained you? I've gotta know. Gun Kaiju, man. That's fucking amazing. Ho! <sighs> I can really feel that one in my calves. Hi there, I'm Bruna. My friends call me Buffy. I'm a ranger. I'm a ranger captain here in New World. What you doing? Well, well, you could say that I'm training for battle by honing my body. We may fight here on New World by turning into monsters, <laughs> but it all starts here with our flesh and blood. Battling requires energy, and I need to maximize my potential energy. If you want to learn a thing or two, maybe you should take my ranger challenge. Are you in a fit enough state to battle me? Uh, let me rewind first. Maybe do some warm up stretches before you come back. God. How many waifus can they possibly throw at me in this game? Um. Alright, let's give it a shot. The other remix of Velocirifle is Gear You. Oh, wow. And its description is Metal Gear Lizard. <laughs> oh, yeah, I think I saw that. Let's do it. Let's do it. I hope I don't leave you too drained of energy. Yo, what's up, Dan? Oh, God. Grass water. Um, I think we're good. In fact, do I have the pear thing? No. But I do have that. Um, oh wait, no, you're gonna mess me up here. I have a big water weakness, don't I? Let's switch to... Found Tess. Hey. AP Donate? What the shit? Oh my god. Um, let me actually lower your guys' accuracy. That's just gonna be good for you. Yeah, I'm not really in a good position for this fight. Last rights? Oh my! Well, at least I got plenty of fusion power. Oh, I'm fucking dead! Help. That is what I like to call big damage.
Oh, I can make you a different type. That'd be pretty helpful, actually. Jesus! Ugh. I'm really working up a sweat right now. Whoa. What the fuck is that? Let me heal. Because I feel like I'll need it. Youch! Very bad. Random debuff. What is AP refund? Confused? Okay. I'll take it. I'll take anything. Oh, nice. It's just doing random shit now. Cool. See if we can give him another one. Burned! There we go. Burned to the ground. I'm guessing it refunds whatever the attack used. Oh. God damn it. Ow. Nice. Keep biting you. Why'd he bite me? It literally just has support moves. Ugh. Well, win by any means necessary. User becomes a ghost and cannot be hit by attacks after three turns. After three turns, the tape breaks? Oh, shit. Despite maximizing my potential, uh, I still find myself out of action. Well done, trainee. You've really earned your gains. Hey. Oh, wow. It gives my classification. Homo sapiens Earth 21C. Grants one extra AP at the start of a battle shared with allies. Ooh. Maybe I should take a break before I pull a muscle or three. I'll show you a thing or three! Neat. Well, that's a cool evolution of uh, Elfless. Ah, fuck it. Whoa! Spit skull. It's just a big fucking dog with a knight helmet. Fantastic. Absolutely fantastic. Mike Lie Cheat Steel Dude. Yeah, basically. Melted. Oh, what? 
Hits one target, gives the target glass bond status. Whoa. I am very debuffed. Cross your heart and hope to die. <laughs> Copper chop you. I need to rest. Unicast again. Um, there's a camp up there. I've been having a think recently. I've spent some time processing my feelings over my time in Morningtown. So much of my time was spent trying to keep people happy. In fact, I spent a lot of time trying to please people. I think maybe I still do. You and me both. That's all well and good, but maybe it's good for me to think of what I'd like to do as well. Otherwise, I'll just burn my myself out. There'll be nothing of me left. What hobbies would you like to take up? I would have to think about that. I feel like when I was younger, I used to have so much more passion for things than I do as an adult. Is that normal? I have no idea. I have absolutely no idea what you're talking about. Did you know I used to play guitar? Same as my dad. My earliest memories are of me are of me sitting on his lap listening to him play. How'd you fit both on his lap? Very carefully. I bought my own guitar in my teens, but I was never particularly good at it. I guess I gave it up, because I guess I felt like any hobby I had should probably amount to something eventually. And well, if I wasn't destined to become a professional musician, what was the point in do- Game's getting a little too real now. A little too real. That's a shame. You know what? You're right. It is a shame that I gave it up. I should do more of me stuff. And I don't even have to do productive stuff. Maybe if I want to sit in bed all day and read awful romance novels, I should do that too. That's the spirit. <laughs> Thanks a million, Mike. It feels good to get this off my chest. After all, we've been fusing into great big monster t monsters together, haven't we? That's something of a bonding experience, if anything. Is there anything else you'd like to get off your chest? Pretty much finished with my cup of tea. What you say? Shall we get back to it then? Damn, it's level three.
Game's getting a little too real now. I gotta say, like... I feel like I still only just started this game, and it's already, like leaving a bigger impact on me than, like, the last four Pokemon games I've played. Oh, shit! We are in, uh, dangerous territory now. Oh god. Oh god. Oh. I'm a little concerned about this! <laughs> oh my god. How many times? This is... This country shows no kindness, stranger. Come. Come. I'm way ahead of you. Let us match these beasts in number. Whoa. What the shit is that thing? All poison. Poison wall. If by that you mean leaving any <laughs> leaving any impact, then yes. Ooh, ice cold art. Can I attack myself? Ow. Oh, they're level 40, jeez. What? Okay, fair fight was the, the play there. Okay, I need to instant KO that poison wall. Block those statuses. The waifus start coming and they don't stop coming and they don't stop coming. No! God dang. Youch! Nice. I can make you glitter type. Oh, it's water. Glitter bomb. Aw, oh, yeah. Aw, oh, looks fabulous. Oh, I can go for a toxic stab now. Ow. Oh, no, no, I'm fabulous. Oh, now we're all fabulous! Oh, don't you hate that about glitter? It just gets everywhere. Whoa, you look badass now.
That's cool. Skelly Jelly? It's sticky and slimy, and it slewed off a jelly tin during battle. You better not eat it, but it might still be useful for something. You would do well to leave before those fiends return. You surely have no reason to remain in such a place as this. Hey. At least let us thank you, you bitch! I am Viola of Messi. Viola! Cello! I am no fighter, but this land has thrust such a role upon me. I do not wish to trouble you with my burdens. What is your quest? To seek the Holy Grail. I mean, my brother and I were both cast to the seas. If I have not, if I have not drowned, perhaps he too came to rest upon these shores. I have been searching for those for some weeks now. A kind soul gifted to me this curious device with which I may protect myself. If you hear a word of my brother, Sebastian, my camp is just weast from here. Fare thee well. Everybody's looking for something. Everybody's looking for something. Neat. Is that the glitter gimmick? Yeah. Yeah, the glitter gimmick is like, make physical contact with any type and it turns it into glitter type. And, um... And then, um... When glitter type make makes when glitter type makes contact with any other type, it makes that glitter type as well. But then, when a non glitter type makes contact with a glitter type, it reverses it. Oops, I just rested twice. Let me just waste all my wood. I think that's how it works. There's a bunch of level 40 dickheads here. I gotta cheese it. Uh, what else can we do? Let's see, there's rumors. Captain Wallace, let's go find this Captain Dickhead. Oh wait, let's see if we can evolve anyone. So, you quit your job because your bosses kept screwing you around? <laughs> Pretty much. It's more than that, though. If I went to work somewhere else, I'd just have another boss giving me orders. The only way to break the cycle is to work for myself. No more bosses. Yeah! Yeah! That's the spirit! No more bosses! Live on your own terms, man! Except for when the terms you want to live by uh, go on strike! Though my career plans have hit a roadblock recently, I think it happened after I fell through time and space and ended up living on Monster Island. <laughs> it happens to the best of us. That's okay. When all else fails, just become a scab. Yeah. Definitely won't get blacklisted or anything. I've had a lot on my mind lately. <laughs> Probably should have bought some supplies, too. I'll just break down all these blocks. Hell yeah. Uh, where's the Captain Wallace quest thing? Oh, was there something under here? No. 
Okay, where the hell is this Captain Wallace? Our Captain Wallace is at the park right now. Is he hiding? What am I looking for? Those guys are dead. Hey, have a good night, Sir Dan. Get some sleep. Have some sweet cassette beast related dreams, possibly. Oh. I have to said you're a promising fighter. I suppose you'll be wanting to take my Ranger challenge. Sure. I hope your training has a strong foundation. You're gonna need to be tough if you wanna bring down my walls. Alright! Oh wait, they're gonna be like defensive. I don't need to parry. Captain Bear. Um, let's get... Let's get Spitzfire out. Man, I miss Tokusect. God, you have six on that wall? Jeez. Melt that shit. Oh, it turns it into a poison wall. Weird. Stop pelting me with Legos! Assholes. God dang it. Oh dear. Bleh. Um, you need to switch. I guess I can ri get rid of Palanglin actually now that I have Southpaw. I need to do that. Um, who would, who would we replace Palangolin with? Maybe Tokusect, actually. Hey. I won't be demolished so easily. Glitter bomb. Whoa, glitter wall. That's cool. Can throw your wall. What? Nice one. 
Battery! Hits one target twice, lands crits if used after charge? Whoa. Cool. Oh, energy wave, nice. That's really good, actually. I built up my walls and you brought them right down. Nice work. Hey. Earth 21C. Plus one duration, cool. Um. All right, who's who's next? Metal woman. Um, let's go search for her. Uh, but first, let's go get Tokusek backed. Can we um actually do that from here? Oh, what the shit! How did I never open that. Guess not. Is it about 10 o'clock? Um, Alright, Palangolin, it's been real. But it's over. I guess maybe I could try out Spark Tan as well. Thwackle. You know what, yeah, let's focus on, like, just trying out new monsters whenever we can. Just to... Just to try them. Um, so let's put Thwackalope on the team. Um, who else is here? Start a gr I'm not putting Throbo on the team. Um, Bulletino. Velocirifle. As soon as Spitzfire evolves, which I assume he will, we'll, uh, try out Velocirifle. Throbo's evolution is kind of cool, though. Oh, is it? Hmm. Interesting. And let's just speed up the process here. Air wall. Air wall? Oh, yeah. I guess that would make sense. Bonjour. Bonjour. Uh, I won't grab that. Au revoir. Au revoir. Alright, let's see what's going on with the metal woman. That'll be a good reason to use Spitzfire, actually. Can I give Spitzfire anything right now? Um, what do I not use? Okay, so I use Inflame like it's going out of style. Um, I don't use Dog Ears like at all, and it's really costly. So what can I replace that with? Plus one Elemental Wall, maybe. Ooh, that's a pretty good passive. Sticky Tongue lowers evasion, maybe. Raises evasion, it's decent. The zoomies, just a quick, a quick attack, basically. Um, plus five accuracy per empty slot. Reduces incoming air type damage by 50%. Hot potato. 
What else could I give you? Oh yeah, the old one too. Zephyr. Just a wind type attack. story. That's not bad, actually. Let's go ahead and give that to you, since I don't have any ground uh, to speak of. Um, Southpaw, let's ditch the dual wield thing. It's just not working out. And let's give you dog ears. give you the, one of these. It's a lot of AP, but it's worth it. Bish Bash. Oh, that's a melee attack. Okay. Hits one target twice, slams crits if used after charge. Can I give you charge? Do I have charge? Let's give you, um, that's pretty good. I'm not using these at all. Um, what was the thing? Oh, yeah, you got boil. That's great. And then you got another one, right? Ice wall. You get copper chopped? Damn. Um, plus one on wall. Yeah, sure. And Thwackalope. Let's, uh... Just get you going here. Oh, you're a melee attacker, okay. costs a lot of AP. Can we give you like a low AP good attack? Um, three. Yeah, that'll work. That'll work. Alright, let's go fight the metal woman. Hey. Oh, that's super good. Hmm. What the fuck? Oh, the floor is lava. When the hell did that happen? Why is the floor lava? Oh.
a little strange. Maybe it's seasonal lava. Maybe it's this guy's fault. Spitzfire doesn't evolve? Well, fuck me then. Artillanoth? What the crap? Uh, fire wind. Well, shit. I'm getting out of here. Toku Kaiju. Okay, that's who we... Th that's the captain. How the hell? Need to find a rock somewhere, man. Or that. You know what? I'll take it. Meditate. What the shit? Makes sense. Levitate this thing up here. Did I never open this? What the hell? I thought I remember doing this puzzle. Excuse me, Baltim. God damn it.
We have the Sonic 06 flying box tick. Damn it. I actually need another rock. Or that box. It's the box. Dank puzzle strats. Whoa. What? Huh? Oh, there's a box right there. Do 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 do. I try to sequence break the game with boxes as hard as possible. Yeah, I bet you could. Although this game honestly feels like it's not really... Like it's kind of leaning into the sequence breaks a little bit. Like you can kind of just go anywhere for the most part. Brax suit? Let's try energy wave. The old one, too. It's literally just a Rapukin. Yeah. Kill your ass. Zoomies. Um, all right, yeah, let's um let's drop off Spitzfire then. As soon as we can. Um Oh, shit! Okay. It just sucks up the box if you drop it. What the fuck do I do now? Please tell me I respawned it. Am I mega boned? I think I might be mega boned. Crap crud. day fire axe mode. Is it still down there? Can I grab it? Oh. I actually don't even remember where it was for a respawn. Oh, there's another box. 
I don't think I can use this, though. I think it has to be that metal box. Yeah. Um... Shit. To the left. Yeah, was it over here? Well, I think I found my first, uh... My first game-breaking quote-unquote glitch. <laughs> well, not game-breaking, just uh, kind of a glitch. That's annoying. What? Air camouflage. Um, I wonder if just resting will reset it. I do wonder how the whole cassette tape monster transforming thing works. It doesn't make sense in the first in the, on the surface, right? I mean, these are just normal cassette players. They're made of plastic. But maybe I'll have the wrong attitude. Maybe focusing too much on the limitations is the wrong way to think about it. Maybe by accepting that the impossible can still happen, we enable it to happen, you know? Why do I silence the age? Oh right, I need to drop off Spitzfire. Um, alright. Spitzfire, it's been fun, but I'm a little disappointed that you don't have a third Arcanine form. So, you're gone. And, um, I guess off-camera, I'll just level up starter grade. So that we can at least see what it looks like evolved next time. Let's get Blossom Rifle in here. Rapid Arms, Ricochet, Multi Shot. Okay, you're pretty much good to go. Where's my metal box? Unless that didn't reset. It didn't reset. God damn it. Okay. Jesus Christ. Um, let's go all the way back here and rest. 
Holy fuck. Do I just need to, like, quit the whole fucking game? What's going on here? Alright, so I don't actually need that box, which is good to know. Yeah, so I guess, like, once the metal box flew off the edge, it literally just disappeared from existence. Alright, this better be the coin I need, or whatever. Ugh. Hits a whole team, destroys walls? Wow. Um... How the hell? Oh! That's just... up there. You just levitate up the wall? I wish. Oh. It's getting late. It's getting real late. You know, I want to see what these guys look like fused. Whoa! Wild Rat Cassell. I guess I'll take that. That's gonna kill you, isn't it? Damn it! Retribution? Are you plastic? Actually, how much damage can you do? Let's see. Let's use a fair chrome tape. Or, um, chrome tape. Oh, I have ceramic tape. Or, 
Recycled. There we go. That's for plastic. What? Oh, got lucky. Rat Cassell. Rat Cassells are towering creatures that somewhat resemble fairground carousel rides. The smaller rats that constantly rotate around the base of their bodies are said only to open their eyes at the moment the creature dies? Jesus. That is unnecessarily morbid. Wow, those are some big stats. Big stats. Alright, now I can fuse. Whoa! Velocilope. Hurricane shards. Nice. Velocilope. All right, let's not fuck this up. Bunch of plastic. Alright, where the hell is the coin for this bitch? Doc? You mind looking up where this lady's coin is? Could you do me a solid... On it, your employee of the month again, Doc. Hang on. There you go. Appreciate you. I hope it's uh, at least somewhere convenient. Whoa, oh, cool depth of field there. It's in a cave on the upper level of the Deadlands. You need to magnetize up a ledge. Deadlands. In a cave on the upper level of the Deadlands. Dino Quarry. Okay. Oh. Sure fire. Aerosol tape? Huh. Whoa. Um, whoa, camera. Holy moly. Best shovel to Harbor Town, head east through Harbor Town outskirts and over to the outskirts of the Deadlands. 
You can use electromagnetism to hover to an upper ledge and explode dead lands. Walk east, southeast until you spot blowing wind on a lower level. Into the wind and it will blow you south where you'll see a cave. Okay. Is where I was. Ah, there we go. Oh, God. I see. Yeah, I, I totally forgot about this area. I remember seeing this bridge and just thinking like, oh, we'll just naturally find our way up there eventually. But you need the electromagnetism. Fuck, fuck. I'm just gonna kill you guys. Repukin! <laughs> Have you encountered the genie butler mania? Yes! The gin and tonic. I've seen it a few times. It's pretty awesome. I believe that's an astral type as well, right? Oh, pff, speaking of which, there we go. That's why you, <laughs> that's why you mentioned. Um, cool, I'll go ahead and record him. I will say there's only one astral type I've seen so far that I actually want to use. It's that Galagor. I just have no idea where it is. What if I told you that it- That's Throbo's remix? Okay. I guess I'll be evolving Throbo then. A mysterious cosmic waiter with impeccable table service. It isn't entirely clear what kind of drinks they serve, only that they are family friendly and not affecting the age rating of the game. <laughs> Is this guy a reference to, um... Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy. Because that's what his head kind of reminds me of. Especially considering how, like, that was supposed to be, like, the cosmic... Um... Was it? I don't remember much about that, actually. I actually don't know much of anything about Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy. They probably should. They probably made the name pun first and then designed the rest.
Well, because, like, I, I don't... I might be grabbing this from absolutely nothing, but I feel like the context of Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy was that it was like a cosmic hotel that was curated by a waiter. Not a waiter, but like a... um like the hotel owner was like that that robot guy with that white globe for a head and then the the two upside down yellow triangles for eyes that might be completely wrong i have no idea Um, oh, there we go. Transforms the user into a copy of the target? Whoa. Hello. I know why you're here. Land is p a perfect urban development opportunity, but I found it first. Uh-oh. Ground. I wouldn't say completely, but it's fairly wrong. Okay. <laughs> Only fairly wrong. I'll take that. Um, okay, so this seems like a whole ass area. Let me focus on that later. Let me just do this stuff. Okay, so hop down, let the wind... The wind is pushing me to a cave. Enter the cave to find a coin? I assume this is supposed to be where the coin is? Look like a unique character. Oh. The fuck? I'm stuck down here. Aha. Ow. What? Oh! Oh, that's cool. These are some cool puzzles. Alright, let me just fucking get rid of you. Another hurricane. Faux fur tape? For beast types? Ugh. I don't like that. God damn it. 
fucking stuck down here. Gah! Alright, is there another cave up here? Or a way to a cave? <sighs> Fine. Just leave me alone. I see why they offer you, like, repels now. Cause fuck. Very difficult puzzle. Ice wall. Oh, I've been here. Mm. Okay, so the first cave entrance is there. Because I think I remember seeing the other cave entrance. Was it down here? Let's check. Oh god. Yeah, there we go. I think that is it. Aha! There we go. Oh shit! Rogue fusion. Ground beast. Try boiling you. Oh, God. Actually, I'm going to need to rewind anyway. Achievement unlocked? Oh, defusing five rogue fusions. Okay. Uh, energy wave. Rapuken! Double Rapuken! Boosh. Can't believe the guide I looked up didn't mention the other entrance at all. It's kind of fucked up. Nice guide. Prima, Prima D's nuts. Fuse material, breathing technique. Where's my coin? Where the fuck's my coin? Because you don't have the quest for the ranger?
Is this for Metal Woman? Because I have the Metal Woman quest. Need to take away your employee of the month award. What I'm looking at says the side quest is called Coin Operated. Um, okay, what does it say is the... Do, does it give you, like, a starting point for that quest? Oh, you need Meredith with you. Okay. Gotcha. Oh wait, did I see Masqueradles ready to go? Yes! Which aspect of the serpent do you embody? Elegance. Yeah! Masqueradle became Mardiusa. That's awesome. The Martiusa isn't an individual, but a hive mind, a collection of tiny serpentile creatures with a singular unified goal. In this case, that goal is for the Martiusa to dress like it is on its way to a fancy ball and to have a good time doing it. Nice. Oh, the hell? My favorite radio show is Sybil FM, hosted by Captain Sybil herself, out in the marshes. Oh. Alright, get over here, Meredith. Who do you have? Oh yeah, I gave you an all-seer. Swap, Thwackalope, and we'll get this thing out of here, and uh, we'll give you Cat 5, oops, I think that's who she had, yeah, Meredith is pretty smash, you would say that. More Kaylee for me. How do I get up there? Don't say I need Mark Echo. What the fuck? 
Meredith! Well, it has been a great stream. Um, I'm going to call it there for today. Uh, <laughs> game working as intended.